Yo, so got another video. We're gonna do a Z06 spats on a Z51. Boom. I know I'm gonna probably catch a lot of flag for this. Oh, it's not a Z06, we do do boom. And it's made for larger, larger wheels. But I got a new set of wheels coming in. Actually, I shouldn't even say coming in because they're actually here. Let's see if we can check these out real quick. So these are the Vertini RF 1.2s. Just give you a little view there. Can't wait to get these on maybe tomorrow. Hopefully, just depends on my tires get here. Wrap this back up. We'll do that later. So yeah, same uh, size, 19s and 20s, but the width is a bit larger went with um it's a nine and a half front and an 11 rear so it'll be running a 305 in the rear and a that's why i got the spats that and they look cool obviously but because there are no videos on the internet of people doing this on a z51 i figured why not so i figured the process is the same you got three bolts here and a the only thing is I don't see the hole that the little clip insert goes into underneath so like I said because there's no videos of this on the internet we're going to uh, see if we can improvise I've heard that you can get it to fit kind of just like forcing it after you screw in the holes so we'll see hopefully it works out and uh You'll be the first to know if it doesn't. So, um, here we go. Okay, so there's a holes here, but they are for your rock guard or shield or whatever. So you're gonna need to add one either right where this ends, which is slightly over the top of this hole, or what I'm thinking I might do is um, dremel a hole into this or just dremel that clip off and just let the double sided tape hold it onto the car because even without this on right here, it's still on here pretty good. It's not going anywhere. So yeah. So here's a little of my handiwork. I dremeled out a little section here so I can uh, basically put the clip that comes off of this part through this part. Not done yet. We'll probably have to cut away a little bit more to make some more space. But once you do that, you can essentially just set this part little rock guard on top of this and should be fine but uh yeah once that's done i will keep you guys posted okay ladies and gents i got one done and it took a little minute but it's good check it out it's on here rather nicely and it's on there sturdy not going anywhere so what you're gonna have to do well, you don't have to, I guess it's your option. I basically just dremel off that entire bottom piece. That way the rock guard could still puncture into that little hole. But yeah, if you cut this part off, you don't have any issues. So I'm going over this whole thing once. Um, to get this on here good, <sighs> cut this off of the bottom, the piece that goes back towards the door. The, the clip because you will not need it there's nowhere for it to go and dremel out this section here maybe about right here right where it curves cut that part off and you should be okay so we're all done and we got them on as you can see pretty good it's not coming off anytime soon one issue that you're gonna run into is uh, these screws come on camera I need you to focus 
they go in the front bumper the three up front that go in here you're gonna have to replace them with something that's a little longer than this um, honestly I'm not sure exactly how much longer it's a trial and error to be honest luckily I had some spares but uh, those are gonna be your only issue other than that a little piece that we cut out before making that easy and uh, we're good to go so we're gonna flash back to this video once the entire reason for doing this is on those over there till then I'll catch y'all later in case anybody wanted to know what your car would look like with uh, Z06 spots Z51 wheels no spacers this is for you You got a little bit of a tuck, but it's not too bad. I would definitely put a spacer on it, though, if you plan to run your Z51 wheels. Or if you have a stock stinger, you can get the spacers. Oh, she looks good, though. Also, I thought I would mention that this is held in now by only one screw. Yeah. The other two see that the originals weren't long enough and I haven't been to AutoZone to get a replacement yet so just the one screw at the bottom but like I said it's held in there fine I'll eventually add another two so just so it's fully fully secure and back to what the way it was so that about does it for this video man I hope you found it helpful uh, like I said, the spats look good. Oh no, the sun. Z06 wing is on the Z51 wing, so I'm gonna be a little. Uh... Alright, so that about does it for this video. Hope you find it. Blah, blah, blah. Fuck. Okay, again. Fuck. Are you gonna do it? No. Alright, so that about does it for this video. I'm about to head out. I hope y'all found this helpful. Uh, hope you like the rims. They weren't too bad, too expensive. Love the tires. The, the PS4S's are dope. This mug just squats and takes off. It doesn't even slide no more. But, um, uh, that's a bad angle. So, I uh, will be up with y'all. Check back in a week. I got another video coming for, uh, Z06 winglets on the Z51 wing, but um, y'all be cool, and uh, check out this little video, just a little, little demo, a little something I'm working on, I'm gonna expand it later, get some more shots in, hopefully you like it, but uh, y'all be cool man, I'm gone.